Hey there, it's Roland from Getting It Done North of 7. Today I'm going to show you how to test the hardness of your water in your home. You can pick up a kit, I'm not sure where, but I know on Amazon, I'm going to leave links down below in the, this video, where you can pick up the test strips. But I have one here, and we're going to try it and see what hardness level our water is. Okay, I grabbed some water out of my tap. We have the test strip here, so we're going to open it here. Okay, we're going to take the hardness strip out of the packet. We're going to dip this strip into untreated water for only three seconds. One, two, three. So you take it out of the glass and you hold it level like this for 20 seconds. Don't shake it or anything. Just leave it be for 20 seconds. So we're looking at about seven seconds now. So there we go. That's about 20 seconds now. And now we're going to compare it to the packet to the color on the packet is it that color i'd say it's that color so it looks like my water softener is working pretty darn good it's uh showing that the water is soft and that's basically all you got to do is get these strips to test your water softener now if your water softener is going to be hard or very hard then you have to adjust your water softener to compensate for that all right so now we're down at the water softener and you're probably wondering, well, how do I adjust my water softener to compensate for the hardness? So you're going to come down here on the Whirlpool water softener and where it says program, push the button. So this is for your current time. Push it again. It says hardness right there. So right here, my water softener is set at 30. If my water was harder, I would crank it up in increments of five until I get it right. After a while, you can keep using different test strips and testing your water and adjusting accordingly till you get it right. My test strip was a little bit lighter than the yellow that was showing soft. So maybe I'm a little too high. I could probably drop it down to 25. So then you just press the program button again, brings you back to the beginning and you're all good to go. Now, if you still find that you have too much hardness in your water, I have other videos on this channel that may help you out. It's all under one playlist about water softeners. Also, I'm gonna be coming out with a video soon and maybe by the time you watch this video, that video is already out. I'm gonna go through different steps of troubleshooting what may be the issue with your water softener and Hopefully together we can solve that issue. And don't forget to get your test strips. Um, go down to the description below this video. There will be a link for you to get those test strips. And I want to thank you for watching and we'll see you on the next video. Mm -hmm.